All right, uh, welcome to Sport right here on uh, Morning Rush, your premier morning show anyway in the country right now. So we start by taking a look at football and former Zimbabwe youth international Elvis Moyo has confirmed signing for Harare Giants Dynamos after agreeing a two-year deal. Now the 29-year-old who arrives from Malai Chiefs is one of almost a dozen players that have linked that have been linked with the glamour boys who are seeking to replenish their squad following last week's clearance Moyo's agent trust nyambia of uh, tkt sports agency yesterday confirmed that the left back had finalized negotiations with dimbari the defender is one of the several new faces that have been spotted at the dynamo's training ground in the last few days so this story continues, exactly. Andy, because we, we spoke about this and we are continuously seeing the same thing. Mm. So Elvis Moyo was with FC Platinum at, his, at the peak of his career. Mm. Went to South Africa, played for Chipa United. Then they, he came back and joined Malawi Chiefs, who were not doing so good. Mm. I think the only notable thing they did last uh, year, they won the Chibuku Super Cup. Mm. So Dynamo's last won the league title in 2014 with the caliber of players they are taking now do you see them getting anything i can't you know, to be honest with you look I, there's no doubt that the man is a useful left back he's got a sweet foot but uh, no i mean you we kept we said this actually the other day when we were chatting off, off off air we said that look unless you can develop bring these youngsters through from the ranks and really get them into your system of playing football is the only way to do this if you're bringing in guys on one year contracts you're looking to see okay let's look for some of these seasoned players to buttress our team i tell you now I, let me make a prediction this is fc platinum's so you're again howard if, we, if other teams are continuing to do this yeah because you, you look at fc platinum yes. why didn't they take him if he was so good yeah. <laughs> You look at Numen Mapesa, the caliber of players that he's going for right now, yet other teams that are also trying to compete for the league championship mm. are going for, I don't want to use the word spent forces, but I'm just saying <laughs> it. <laughs> you know, well, look, Awad, I think yesterday we really emphasized the issue of recycling of players, not even identifying new talent that boosts the team's performances. So I think it's a really sad development that needs to be discussed within the soccer fraternity to say how else can we move. Uh, soccer to another level. How can we incorporate new talent from um, uh, sports academies and so forth? Because look, I'm not seeing much value that the guy is bringing. Or, I mean, if he have once been in South Africa, comes back, joins another team that is not doing so well, Dynamos captures him. I don't know, maybe it's the combinations that they are looking at. Maybe they want to pay him with another good foot so that um, the best <laughs> can come out of that. <laughs> Trust me, if you ask me, there's nothing like that. There's nothing like Combinations? that. Combinations? There's nothing like that. Uh, uh, there's no. nothing like that.